hi guys uh, good evening and welcome back today one of the company has announced its results so we will try to understand that this is also one of the uh, blue chip uh, company which is announced its results results seems to be very good and uh, like you know there are reasons as well this may this stock might uh, perform uh, well in the coming days as well so that and all we will discuss uh, before going to that let me give a disclaimer that the content we are discussing is only for educational purpose it is not a buy or sell call guys so uh, please make sure uh, to uh, read all the related documents before making any investment decisions guys so without any further delay directly let us get into it so that is the company is none other than avenue supermarts limited so all, also we call it as a dmart so the company uh, has announced its uh, results so if you look at the results uh, it has year on year sales 19 percent up is there and ebit uh, 18 percent up is there and net profit 17 percent up is there and eps 17 percent up is there all and all it is a fantastic result for this company and it's one of the uh, blue chip uh, company which is having the market capitalization of market cap of uh, 3.22 lakh crores guys so it is uh, if you look at uh, the six month performance it is given 28 percent and if you look at uh, the last one year performance it is still it is given 28.95 uh, percent and if you look at five year performance it is uh, 264 percent uh, returns it has given and if you look at the maximum performance uh, it has given uh, 702 percent so if you look at the uh, last one year uh, so it is almost like you know trading in this particular way so not a uh, one year performance from uh, april it is a uh, kind of a consolidation uh, zone it is uh, there guys so i think this uh, consumer durables uh, as you all know that the uh, demos is uh, into the uh, consumer durables so this stock may uh, uh, perform in the coming days as well because so this nda led government is uh, there in our uh, uh, there in the indian government right so this is a coalition government along with the tdp and other parties so bjp has not uh, a full majority government so it is a coalition government that there are a lot of expectation from the budget that the government is uh, focusing on the consumer durables and consumer spendings basically be it by in increasing the tax the slabs and all so a lot of expectation is there if that is uh, working out if that is happened so then definitely these are the stocks which are which will perform very well in the coming days as well so directly like i opened this uh, pdf document from the official website and i opened this is the document so if you look at the uh, consolidated so here both are there a standalone report is also there and consolidated report is also there also there please make sure like you know whenever we uh, are uh, studying the financial results uh, make sure to study the uh, consolidated financial result because standalone consists of its own uh, but consolidated will consist of all together say for example company is having a uh, multiple subsidiaries all together will come into consolidated financial re uh, financial results okay so all the numbers are in uh, crores so it, this is the last uh, year june quarter this is the march quarter and this is the june quarter of uh, this year please make sure that so first uh, we will come to this total income 11904 crores uh, is the revenue uh, in the last year june quarter so then comes uh, 12764 crore in the last march quarter now it has 14110 crores in the this particular june quarter so year on year and quarter on quarter in the revenue perspective the growth is there fantastic so then comes the total expenses the total expenses also 11000 crores in the last year 12000 crores in the last quarter and 13000 crores in this particular quarter so after removing the expenses from the total income we will get the pbt so profit before tax this is very very important guys so last year it was 870 897 crores in the last quarter 763 crores in this quarter 1054 crores these are the magical numbers so it has grown up from 763 to uh, 1054 crores so year on year and quarter on quarter both growth is there and after that we have to remove the taxes from the ppt so then we will get net profit after tax profit after tax that's what we call it as 658 crores in the last year and 563 crores in the last quarter and 773 crores in this particular quarter this is a fantastic numbers guys the two for a uh, kind of a blue chip company so then comes uh, the same thing we can see uh, uh, eps format earning per share so in the last uh, year 10.14 and in the last quarter it was 8.66 uh, then comes this quarter it is 11.89 so year on year and quarter on quarter both growth is there and fantastic result i checked the report and as of now there is no dividend uh, kind of a news 
dividend related no news is there i think the company is not giving any dividend uh, it has not declared any dividend uh, for now so uh, i i opened this document in order to set the context clear so that you can also read and you can also go through the report so this is the standalone uh, report guys so if you want to go through it you go to go to the nse website and you can uh, visit this company and uh, go to the announcement and from financial results update you can download this pdf and you can go through this uh, so this is uh, all and all a fantastic result uh, for this kind of a company and i think uh, hopefully we will get a good result and good returns from this kind of a company in the coming days if the budget theme is working out as we discussed okay so as we talked so there is a kind of a people a centric or populous budget uh, may happen we don't know exactly only when nirmala sitaraman announces the budget on july 3rd 23rd we will get to know so until that all we can expect that we can expect this we can expect many things here and there gossips and uh, many things will be going on many gossips and news will be keep on uh, going here and there but don't worry about that maybe sometimes uh, 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 stock market reacts to reacts to such news as well so because that market will anticipate early before the action so that is what important so we should be able to recognize it early but don't take the decisions before uh, like you know studying and having the clear uh, decision and the clear news or uh, the clear picture uh, don't invest so once you have the clear picture that this will definitely go happen then only take your decision guys so that's all i wanted to tell you thank you thank you so very much we'll see you in the next video guys if you like my content please hit the like button and do comment do share and subscribe to my channel thank you guys thank you so very much